Just like any block, dynamic blocks can include attributes and fields. In this video, I'll show you how to create a dynamic block that will display the coordinate of the insertion point of your block. An attribute is a label or a tag that attaches data to a block. Attributes can reference fields. Fields are dynamically linked properties that update automatically when the object property changes. The block in this drawing will reference an insertion point and will update if the point is moved. Let's consider this block that I have in the drawing. I'm going to use the block editor to add an attribute to this tool. To get to the block editor, on my insert pan tab, I'll go to the block definition panel and use the block editor tool. I'm going to choose this block that I've already created and choose OK. Now you might notice that when I got into the block editor, for whatever reason, it got rid of my hatch that was in here. Sometimes that happens with the block editor, so I'm simply going to add that hatch back in real quick and choose OK. Now, to add the attribute, on the Insert tab, you can go to Define Attributes, and this dialog box will come up. You need to give it a tag. The tag may not have any spaces in it. I'm simply going to give it the name coordinate. I do not need a prompt because I don't want it to ask me about the information when I insert it. I just want it to insert it all by itself. And then instead of entering a value for it, I'm going to use the field. To use a field, you simply click on this button right here. And then you scroll down to where you find object. And then use this button right here that says select object to pick your circle. Once I've chosen the circle, AutoCAD knows everything about this circle, including the center of the circle. So I've chosen center here. You can see that it's giving me a preview of the x, y value in the current units. And I have the z value unchecked because in this case, I'm only going to be using this block in two dimensional drawings. Once that's all done, I can choose OK. And then the last thing I want to do is I want to make sure that I uncheck verify and check preset. Preset is going to allow it to insert the block without asking me about it every single time. And then I'm going to change the height of my text so that it's appropriate for this block. I'll set it at a sixteenth of an inch. And then I'm just going to simply align it with that point right there, close the block editor, and save the changes. Now it won't show up on this initial block, but every new block that I insert will have that new coordinate associated with it.